The Honor flagship phones are often really good value for money as they basically just pilfer the best hardware from some of those top end Huawei smartphones but then seriously trim the asking price as well. Great news if you like your premium tech but you want Mr or Mrs money bags. For instance here on the arse end of the shiny new Honor 20 Pro you get some seriously slick camera tech. A quad lens setup complete with ultra wide angle and telephoto lenses plus a new macro lens for some extreme close up action. I thought I'd test out how good the Honor 20 Pro's quad lens camera setup really was for your everyday day photos and videos. So I've been taking it out and about each day with the Huawei P30 Pro and the OnePlus 7 Pro to see if it could handle the pace. So here's my in-depth camera comparison and for more on the latest and greatest mobile tech please do pop subscribe and ding that notifications bell. Cheers! Now the Honor phone and that OnePlus 7 Pro sport almost identical optics besides the addition of that macro snapper. Here on the OnePlus you once again have a 48 megapixel primary shooter with Sony's IMX586 sensor, although the aperture isn't quite so gaping, and that's sat alongside similar wide angle and telephoto lenses. And the P30 Pro once again offers up the flexibility of a wide angle and telephoto viewpoint as well, although this time around you get a mighty 5 times optical zoom instead of the 3 times zoom of the others, courtesy of that snazzy periscope design. That's all the techie bollocks out of the way, but now onto the good stuff. How do these three actually compare for photo and video quality? Well, for your everyday shots as far as detail levels are concerned, it is basically a dead heat between all of these blowers. Not really surprising considering the strength of those primary lenses. When you blow up each photo, it is rare to see a difference in clarity between the three. Zoom right in and everything still remains crisp and clear. Colours are often captured differently, however, depending on your choice, especially with the Honor and Huawei's AI mode in play. This could often tweak the colours slightly to make them more palatable. Slap this off and you'll get more natural results instead. In comparison, the OnePlus 7 Pro has no separate AI feature and those colours are given a slight boost where appropriate. When shooting against a bloody bright sky, the Honor 20 Pro reproduced the subject with as much detail as the others here, while also capturing those rich attractive blues behind it, especially with that AI mode active. In extremely bright conditions, those Honor and Huawei handsets are still capable of producing warm good looking results, while the OnePlus 7 Pro occasionally just can't quite keep up. It is very rare to see any proper oversaturation or whitewashing with any of these phones however, they all basically excel when it comes to high contrast situations. And as far as indoor HDR shots are concerned, the OnePlus 7 Pro captures the most natural looking photos, while the Huawei and Honor phones pick out more detail in those darker areas. Now that special macro lens on the Honor 20 Pro does actually help you to grab more detailed up close and personal shots from a distance of mere centimetres, although it isn't quite infallible with a very narrow range, so you're definitely best off taking a couple of snaps to ensure you get a good result. The P30 Pro results came very close indeed, while the OnePlus 7 Pro is clearly in last place in this round, struggling at this extreme distance. Change up to the ultra wide angle lens and you'll be able to shoot enormous buildings and other massive scenes without buggering about with panorama modes and the like. The actual angle is identical between all three of these phones and the Honor and Huawei handsets produce very similar results with quite warm hues on offer. Meanwhile the OnePlus 7 Pro captures cooler images overall with the same level of detail. If you're obsessed with long distance shooting then the P30 Pro is by far your best bet. The mighty and so far unmatched 5 times optical zoom produces stunning pics from afar, absolutely crammed with detail that you'll have no hope of seeing with the naked eye. The next best option here is definitely the OnePlus 7 Pro. That 3 times optical zoom seems to capture sharper detail from a distance compared with the Honor 20 Pro for a more attractive and defined finish. The results are often brighter as well, while the Honor 20 Pro produces unnaturally warm photos with its long distance snapper. At night time, using the standard auto mode, the Honor 20 Pro and Huawei P30 Pro often serve up slightly better pics than than the OnePlus 7 Pro. The OnePlus does occasionally overexpose those lighter elements in order to produce a bright photo. It still looks good, but just not as good. However, bring the specialist night modes into play and the OnePlus seriously impresses. The Honor 20 Pro and P30 Pro offer brighter results and bolder colours with that long exposure feature, but the OnePlus's Nightscape version 2 successfully cuts out that overexposure for a really clean and clear finish. Considering how fast it is to use as well compared with the others, these photos are very impressive indeed. All three blowers here serve up a portrait mode as well, with the Huawei and Honor phones once again offering the same effects and very similar results. You can add a bokeh style blur into the background and add all kinds of weird filters if that's your bag. In comparison, the OnePlus 7 Pro offers a more straightforward effect, but the edge detection is strong on all three of these phones and the results are definitely pretty. Switch it up to video mode and the OnePlus 7 Pro is the most capable handset on paper at least, offering up to 4K resolution recording at 60 frames per second, while the Huawei and Honor top off at 30fps at that Ultra HD level. Still, you will not be disappointed with the footage you grab with any of these devices. Stick them on 4K and you get gorgeously crisp results with a nice punchy kick for those colours. Audio pickup is 
fine and the focus definitely handles light and distance changes perfectly on all three of these phones. Plus, even at that Ultra HD level, these blowers deliver dependable image stabilization. You will notice a slight shimmer in the picture with every step, but that is pretty much it. Definitely nothing puke inducing. Flip to the selfie camera and you'll get great results no matter your choice as well. Even on crazy bright days with plenty of sky action, your face will stay bright and sharp. You do of course get portrait mode smarts with all three of these phones as well, and this seems to work best on the OnePlus 7 Pro. The Huawei and Honor edge detection with just a single lens to rely on can be quite aggressive. Lop it off ear lobes and other bits of your bonds. And that right there is how the Honor 20 Pro stacks up against the OnePlus 7 Pro and the Huawei P30 Pro as far as everyday photo and video quality is concerned. What do you reckon? Which one is your favourite smartphone snap? would definitely be great to hear your thoughts down below. And please do poke subscribe and ding that notifications bell for more on the latest and greatest tech. Cheers everyone. Love you.